This demo about the PC brushless motor controller. This controller range is 6 to 60 volts, 400 watts. Here I will show you how to operate and how to use and connect the cable. I have the different controller for the BLDC motor. So here I will show you how to control the hoverboard motor with the PC brushless motor controller. I have other controllers also available. Uh, this one, this is different model. This is uh, 384. And this also, uh, I have another demonstration about this one. Designed for uh, uh, minimum voltage, means less than 20 volt, you can control the hoverboard motor from 20 to 50 volts. And uh, uh, here, another model, uh, this one, 24 to 50 volts, but uh, these two controllers, the option is uh, their watts are more and uh, you can control without the hall sensor cables. So only you have to connect the three phase to the motors and apply the voltage, enable, and PWM control the motor speed, stop, start, reverse, forward, everything you can control. So this is the difference. But uh, this controller I tried but without connecting the hall sensor cables uh, the motor didn't run. Phase A, B, C and then positive then negative volt. Here you I will apply from 42 volts. Uh, same hoverboard uh, battery or the uh, adapter. Even I tried this with uh, 12 volt. It is working so I will use the car battery 12 volt car battery also it is working this phase A B C then positive supply then negative. This I can connect with the uh, battery as well as same overboard charger it is working also on 12 volt I will try it is working here this one is the cables for the hall sensor first here positive supply then negative supply and then three sensors but uh, the cable which i connect for the sensors this codes which is coming with the controller and which is with the uh, here you can see from the hoverboard this little difference negative and power supply okay but the uh, here you can see blue cable is there but here not available so i connect the white cable with the blue one so after that uh, when i connect the three faces this three phase a b c m1 m m a m b m c with the motors what happened it uh, was not running correctly then I change the phase only two phases I change so it uh, works well it is due to this hall sensors so now I will show you how to run this one okay here I will connect the power adapter okay now you can see the power supply light is there uh, reverse forward uh, one for the enable uh, means uh, start stop switch here PWM controller actually it is having uh, PWM on on board itself if you want to control from here you can control otherwise i also connect with this one and uh, here you can see uh, there is uh, one jumper is here okay if you put the jumper what will happen it will disable this one and now after that you can control by this the external potential meters okay let's start okay this is working. Okay, now you can see with slow speed it is working. Okay, this one. Okay, now you can see the reverse also working. If I change, it change the direction. So when you change the direction, better to keep with slow speed. With high speed, it will jerk your uh, trolley or whatever you want to control the motor. Stop. On. Forward. Reverse. Speed. Okay. 
key if i keep it on minimum so now i will control with the this potentiometer uh, the speed of the motor is on make it on then i will can control with the this potentiometer also stop start reverse forward okay now speed okay no i will stop then i will try uh, with the 12 volt uh, battery okay power off i will remove the power from here no i will no i will apply the 12 volt battery so male and female okay 12 volts now you can see i will enable motor rotates we will control the speed high power see it's very powerful you cannot stop even this reverse so the people those cannot update the software with stm32 board they can use this board this is uh, no need any software uh, also if you don't know how to upload the software here and control the motor both motors you can use the this one if you want to see how to uh, firmware of motherboard or oh, overboard you, i have another video on this one is uh, you can see there in my videos uh, is very a good uh, demonstration and complete uh, you can uh, find how to firmware your motherboard of the hoverboard so now i am controlling with this one okay here i show already faces motors connections then this positive then input pwm motor speed control then this ground then uh, motor direction and uh, stop stop switch so this is very easy you can do it by yourself and connect your overboard motor with this controller if you want to know how to connect this board this also this controller i have another video and uh, if you want to see this one this is different model it is having masters on all three faces uh, this i will uh, uh, upload the video uh, sooner so it's very good thanks for watching please subscribe my channel thank you very much